Hello, today we're going to look at a drawing technique called cross contour drawing. Cross contour drawing is using lines that follow the contour of the object to make it appear more three dimensional or more as a form. If you take a look at these two images, this drawing on the left appears to be very flat. This drawing is called a shape, whereas this drawing appears to have more depth and dimension. So it gives the illusion of a form. So how do we determine where these lines go? Well, we're gonna do a little exercise. So those lines basically describe the path that your finger would follow or the path that um, an object touching your form would follow if it were to wrap around the, the actual object itself. So my finger would go down and then up and then down. So if we were going to draw, make this shell here, a cross contour drawing, if we were going to do a cross contour, the first thing that we would do is we would kind of find the area like closest to us and what is the path that your finger would follow if it were tracing along the shell. So that is one path right there. So that establishes, now if I were to rub back this way, my finger would follow along this path. So this kind of helps us establish where our lines would go. So now I can, if I'm going to rub around this way, my lines could also cross this shell and then this shell actually already kind of has its own cross contour lines naturally and then these lines would go this way okay so if I were to draw this shell on my paper if I were just drawing the shape or the outline it would look something like that which looks pretty flat but then once I draw in those contours and I remember where I would put the lines if I were actually drawing on my shell which when you're when you're doing a real drawing in, in real life you wouldn't actually draw on the object but this is kind of just to help you see where those contour lines would go and why they go in the direction that they do okay so this here would be more of an accurate, more dimensional drawing of the shell. And very, very simple, very, only a few lines.